I'd like to, I'd like to ask you, uh, uh, do you have a response to uh, Taylor Swift endorsing uh, Joe Biden? There's the well-worn joke that Taylor Smith has a long history of writing music about all of her terrible choices in men, and now here we have her making another one. And, I, and I'm and, I, and, and I'm gonna let I'm gonna let Taylor finish, but Joe Jorgensen is the greatest political candidate of all time. So so I'm glad you, that you're quoting uh, our our good friend uh, Kanye West. Now would yes. you be going on MSNBC and endorsing uh, Kanye West just like you know you are a Libertarian Party vice presidential candidate? Listen, person. listen, listen! Don't tempt me, okay? No, I I. I I, I want to. I want to tell you something. No, uh, we are not going to make the uh, any Weldian mistakes in this cycle. Uh, we're not going to uh, accidentally or intentionally endorse any other candidates. And when I am asked about Aleppo, I'm going to tell them what we know that Aleppo is a hybrid between a leopard and a hippo. And you know, if Gary had known that, then we could have avoided all of that. But unfortunately, we are where we are. But we know that now, and moving forward, we can avoid that whole nightmare. So, so uh, Spike, uh, speaking of Taylor Swift, uh, just about a year ago, me and Seth put out this new song, and uh, it was released on, on Amazon Digital and different places around the internet, and uh, we beat Taylor Swift the week that her new album came out and became a top 10, no, top 20, excuse me, top 20 digital charting hit band with our song Family Reunion Pop Version Remix. And uh, so what my question is, is if if we were to endorse you and Governor Jorgensen and you guys, you know, when you win, you're going to have to have yeah. one of these big things where Ted Nugent style concert happens like, you know, at the at the, at the White House. Well, how about you don't get a guy like that? You get all them. These are old Blakely boys that beat Taylor Swift. I don't know. What, I'm not 100% certain what you're asking me. What I'm asking you is if you win. No, I, I got win, that part. If I, when, when we win, yes. So when you win, uh, you let Seth and Willie Fred play down there at the White House? Sure. Okay. All right, that's all we need to know. Ladies, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to say that me, as a citizen of Blakely Trailer Park, who will not be involved in the tyranny of the United States election. I, 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 Willie Fred, will endorse Joe Jorgensen and Spike Cohen, not because of anything that Spike said here tonight, other than the fact that he don't like Taylor Swift. And I don't like Taylor Swift either. And that is perfectly I mean, fine. That's, that's a reason right there. I will, I will vote for Spike, mail-in style, to Spike everybody. <laughs> Just so I can play down there at the White House when they get elected. Eat that, Taylor. Yeah, yeah, Taylor. By the way, I didn't say I don't like Taylor Swift. I said that. She, now don't she's, make me gonna, take it back, Spike. She's not, don't she's not gonna me. date. Well, I already got your endorsement, so no backsies. What I said is that she, that she is not, that I, according to her own discography, if she did choose me, I'd have to rethink who I am as a person. Hey, she just break up with you and then write a song about you.